Hi there, everyone. I'm meteorologist Rusty Dawkins for Hale Varsity, and we've got a Husker football game coming up on Saturday, Northwestern coming to town. First weekend in October, the leaves are just starting to change around here, a fall feel to the atmosphere. And of course, that means we're going to see a chance for scattered showers and maybe an isolated thunderstorm. That's Nebraska weather for you. Now, by noon, this is what this latest model is saying. Now, this is going to change a little bit as we head through the next couple of days. But at the time of this recording, this is what this one uh, model that I rely on on quite a bit is saying and I trust it pretty good so we'll, we'll see how it does but by noon one o'clock in the afternoon everything's basically south of interstate 80 but it's making its way north and I think by about two o'clock in the afternoon light rain starts to move in uh, and across interstate 80. Now this is just light to moderate rainfall uh, scattered showers but maybe an isolated thunderstorm every now and then you start to see those yellow pockets popping, uh, popping up that's a heavier precipitation and maybe just a little more instability. We could see an isolated thunderstorm. This doesn't look like it's going to be a huge widespread lightning everywhere kind of, of storm. But every now and then, and we've kind of been seeing this over the last few days, uh, where there's a pocket of thunderstorms over here and just light rain over here. So that, that's kind of what's going to be happening with this. The chances there for a thunderstorm, but overall it just looks like light to moderate rainfall. Uh, this continues into uh, 5 o'clock in the afternoon. I noticed light to, light to darker greens mostly, but pockets of yellow here and there. So an isolated thunderstorm possible. Game time between 6 and 6.30, still some light to moderate rainfall. Starting to thin out a little bit, not gone, by 7 o'clock and by halftime. It's still out there but you notice it's thinning out a little bit it's moving to the east but something will try to come back around from the north and i think by nine o'clock most of it's out of here but still a chance at an isolated shower or thunderstorm as it exits the region i think most of the rain will try to be done but notice this is 10 p.m and this model is still picking up a chance for an isolated thunderstorm by 10 o'clock so the best chance for rain will be the afternoon hours as we get through the game. I think it'll start to taper off, but never completely out of the woods for an isolated uh, thunderstorm. So that's just something to keep in mind as we get closer and closer to game time. Keep an eye on the forecast in case it changes a little bit so you know what to wear and what to be prepared for during the game. So this is the forecast right now. Got about a 40% chance for showers and thunderstorms by 6 p.m. That chance is higher during the afternoon, uh, but by kickoff around 6 or 6.30, I think the temperatures, which are going to be fantastic, by the way, will be in the upper 60s by 6 p.m., but a 40% chance. I'll just keep that 40% chance in throughout the entire game. North wind at 5 to 15 and temperatures dropping into the lower 60s. How's that uh, by 10 o'clock by the end of the game? Uh, so overall, chance for rain, better chance in the afternoon in the early evening hours, and then everything should taper off. Off, but still still a possibility as we head through the game so if there's any updates uh, at Husker Weather on Twitter and Facebook I'll have the updates there uh, also on my Rusty WX uh, especially the Twitter account I'm always always on that account and Hale Varsity uh, will have updates posted there too on all of their social media channels Facebook Twitter and Instagram but uh, hopefully we stay dry for, dry for this uh, uh, this game but we'll see what happens uh, stay dry go big red